It's been in partner with the U.S. Army for, for several decades now, not only the U.S. Army, but the larger DOD. We do everything from EO, uh, electro-optical and thermal imaging sensors that go on helicopters and ground vehicles, uh, to uh, chem-bio detection rate uh, sensors that uh, support uh, really being able to, define, to find and uh, defend against uh, chemological and bio biological attacks. Uh, we also have nano drones, as you see, to, see here today with our Black Hornet 3, that do uh, layered surveillance. Uh, and that allow us and our customers to really do uh, things that we haven't been able to do before on the battlefield with respect to uh, surveillance and keeping our, uh, our soldiers out of harm's way. So the Black Hornet 3 is a, is a great product. It's a uh, 31 to 32 uh, gram uh, nano drone, very, very small. Uh, it flies out to about two kilometers. Uh, it has about a travel time of about 30 minutes, between 25 and 30 minutes. And it really is, is, is a layered defense capability that allows you to do surveillance as a soldier. Right now it's being used by our special operations community as well as the Army uh, for layered surveillance. So when a uh, special ops, special operator is behind a, a hill and he wants to see what's on the other side, instead of putting himself inside of harm's way and maybe being shot, you're able to, to launch the, uh, the Black Hornet, see on the other side. You want to be able to understand, are there one bad guy, is there ten bad guys, is there seven good guys, is it, is it friendly forces, so that you can make the right choices because people on, you know, people's lives are on the line with whatever decision you have to go make. So, you know, we're starting to see that application uh, in our uh, Customs and Border Security community, uh, where uh, with the new version that we have, the Black Hornet 3, allows you to go in and out of uh, buildings, go inside of uh, caves, so that if you think about the problem, Problem on the border with drugs being come up, coming under the cave, uh, being able to use this to uh, keep people out of harm's way as you go in and look to see if there are people down there before you go in and, and prosecute a mission. It's really an opportunity for us to do things the right way and prevent injury.